Hey guys and welcome to Karim, Clara and Hinchan. Today we are on our way to Carmiel because we're gonna pick up a fully vegan cake for my sister ball day. It's not our official ball day tomorrow but we just uh, celebrate all year. Um, so I ordered a Raffaello vegan cake with beautiful topping on top from a business called Sivan. I'm sorry I can't really remember. I'm gonna put our logo somewhere here or here. Uh, yeah, but before we pick it up, we're gonna stop at a restaurant called a Cafe Yotfat or Yotfat Coffee. It's not a fully vegan restaurant, but we're gonna check what the uh, goodies, what vegan goodies they have on the menu. Plus, they have 50% if you have the vegan active member. So we're gonna uh, use it this time. Hopefully, we'll remember because it happened uh, in past time that we eat in a place that have this uh, discount and we completely forgot to use it, so it was on us. Okay, so we'll see you then. and we're here at Kibbutz Yot Fat. Now let's find the restaurant. So here we finally managed to find a restaurant. Unfortunately, it had 30 minute waiting time for a table since the restaurant was so packed. But it turned out for the best since we had some time to explore this beautiful place. The place had a bunch of unique stores and also some artist stands. Uh, here we visit some store that sell all kind of homemade gems. And I'm thinking about taking this one. I never saw a cherry tomato jam, so let's try. Wow, look at this size. It's bigger than some onion. Have to grow your own crystal? <laughs> so here I took cherry tomato and fig jam and olive oil for hen. After around 20 minutes or so, they called us and said that our table is ready. So here is the menu. Something to improve is to add a vegan sign next to the vegan dish so it'd be easier to pick without consulting your waitress. We choose the vegan shakshuka that comes with a small salad as well as the artichoke sandwich also comes with a small salad. Chen took a big cappuccino and I took a lisheva soda. So here we got our dishes and I gotta say their aesthetic and food presentation is just beautiful. You can see for yourself. Okay, so here we got the food. Here we have the shakshuka tofu and this is the artichoke sandwich. Let me show you. Come with artichoke, lettuce, tomato, onion and all so many goodies. And I see here some cashew nuts that I like. On the side we have a 
small salad. I think this is tahini and some bread. And we're gonna dig in now, so itadakimasu. Okay, and now for the vegan review. Because except for being pleasing visually, we need them to please our taste buds. The artichoke sandwich was really fresh and you can feel that the bread was baked on the place. Uh, I also love the pesto sauce they put in it, uh, just delicious and I'm gonna give it a 9. Also the small lettuce salad was really well seasoned and I like its sauce. And now, as for the shakshuka. The tomato sauce was alright, but it kind of felt they didn't give too much thought to the tofu and just throw it inside. The tofu stayed in its original form, it wasn't seasoned or tempered with. Even adding some black salt could improve the dish and give it this sulfur flavor to mimic the egg. So overall I'm gonna give it a 6. It also comes with a small side salad, uh, this one with cucumber and tomato seasoned with olive oil. But if to be honest, I prefer the lettuce one that Han had. I also really like the Alisheva soda. It was a simple soda drink, but the gradient of color was so beautiful. And it also was very fresh and sparkly. And yeah, it went really well with the dish. So overall, I'm gonna give this all experience an 8.5. It was a lovely place to sit in, it had a great ambience, and it was also a great spot to fly my Mavic. And if it's not too crowded, you can also sit in the balcony outside and enjoy the view. Look at this cute little mobile there in the bathroom. Okay, so we just finished our visit at Cafe at Fat. Unfortunately, just when we were about to leave, the electricity fell down and it's not uh, on until now, like, I don't know, half an hour later. So we just leave our details and they're gonna call us on Sunday to figure it all out. Now we're gonna pick up my sister cake uh, from Carmiel. It's gonna be like, uh, I think, 20 minutes to 30 minute drive. It's pretty close. Um, and yeah, we'll see you then. So we got the cake, the precious cake is here, we put it all down there and she gave us like a block of ice to put on it so it will survive. We have one hour drive until the full so hopefully it will survive. I don't know if you can pick here, so it's right there. She also gave us two chocolate, this one with peanut butter and this one a uh, Faero style. Oh, and they're cold and we're gonna snack on them right now. So this one is with the peanut butter. This is like the Hershey's peanut butter cup, which I really like. It's less sweet. I think uh, she had less sugar in this, but yes. it's really good. I like it. Um, those snacks are also going to be on the cake in different colors, of course. It's really nice quality. It's chocolate with nuts. Hazelnuts, I think. Let's try. Mm. Still frozen. I probably should let it down, melt a bit. Mmm, mm, that's so good. Mmm, I like it. It kind of reminds me of Tiami, but with a nutty flavor. I think I like this one more. Mm -hmm. This one gets a 9 and the other one 8.5. Okay, so here is the precious cake and yeah, it looks like it survived the whole way, one hour drive. I made it. So. I got it. Yeah. Happy birthday! So here we have the tenim jam and Hen is just spread it on the bread and you're gonna try it now. It's with no sugar this one. And I think it's homemade. Yeah, it's homemade konditori. I think it also have some like here big pieces inside. Mm, it's nice. 
Here we go. Big one. Hmm? I like it. It's not that sweet, but the food is uh, sweet on its own. I actually like it. I didn't think I'm gonna like it because I don't really like uh, tedium, but it's nice. I give it 8.7. At the end, my family surprised me and celebrated to my sister and I a combined birthday party in a tropical team. We celebrate with lots of food that we used to create shakes like that. Okay, and that was my sister and I combined birthday party. I hope you enjoy. If you like, please leave a like and subscribe. And for now, bye bye.